Hi, how are you guys doing today? This is Harvey Jackson with Great Commission Evangelism Ministry. And this is day six of our 15-day prayer vigil. So I hope you're ready. And it's Sunday morning. It's a great day. It's a day, great day that the Lord has made. And hey, look at this. Woo, look at that sunrise. Isn't that such a beautiful sunrise right there? Oh, man, what a morning to wake up. And, see, and be able to see the sun shining on your face and be able to wake up and give God praise. Yes, it is. But today we are going to continue with our 15 day prayer vigil and we're going to look at Ephesians chapter 6, verses 10 through 20. So let's go on and read that. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God that ye may be able to stand against the wells of the devil. For we do not wrestle against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against rules of darkness of this age, against spiritual hosts of wickedness in heavenly places. Therefore, take up the whole armor of God that ye may be able to withstand the evil day, having done all to stand. Stand therefore, having girded your waist with truth, having put on the breastplate of righteousness, and having shod your feet with the preparation of the gospel of peace, and above all, taking the shield of faith, which you will be able to quench all the fiery, fiery darts of the wicked one, and take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the Spirit, which is the word of God, praying always, with all prayer and supplication in spirit, being watchful with all perseverance and supplication. And for me, utterance may be given that I may be able to open my mouth boldly to make known the gospel. And for I am an ambassador in chains, that I may speak boldly as I ought to speak. And that last part, I'm praying that you'll pray for me that when it's time to go, as I go out and reach people, and as our t prayer team goes out and reach people, that we will be able to boldly speak the gospel to those that talk to us. Because sometimes there will be people out in the yard as we're heading out, heading out there, the door hanger, and they'll be asking, what are you doing? For? And by the way, those that just came on to this 15-day prayer vigil, we're going out to the city of Victorville. That we are going to be going house to house praying for people. Praying for the house, putting the door hanging on the house, letting them know that we pray for them, and leaving it up to them. And we're hoping that they will call us back and ask for prayer, let us know how they're doing, and hopefully some also show interest in what we're doing, want to join the Bible study. So that's what this is all about. So keep us in prayer as we're doing that. Pray that God will open the hearts of those in Victorville. Pray that God will protect the children as as we're going out and also protecting from predators and things like that that God will take down the spiritual strongholds that might be holding people back from knowing Jesus Christ the personal Lord and Savior and also going to God 